It's my feel-good breakfast show. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's a Friday, and it's time for the moment of truth. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No. I've, got to, I've got to hold it for effect. It's the moment yeah, of truth. Dun, 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 dun. It was already there, all right? It was there. So, yes, OK, Mother's Day is <laughs> it's just around the corner. Um, you know, it's a day where we spoil our mothers a little more than usual, actually. But, Graham, we want to ask you the question, man. Have you been actually uh, taking note of what your mother's been telling you over these past couple of years, man? And she tries right? really hard to drum it into my head. <laughs> yeah, I know this, but... Um, with the attention span of a goldfish, you know, I think it's, <laughs> it has been quite difficult for my mom over the years. I, I make no mistake. So the thing is this, dude, uh, yesterday we called your mama. <laughs> we called your mama. And we asked her a series of questions that a, that a, that a doting and a very attentive son should have asked. And All right. Should know, should right? Know. So we're going to ask you these questions. We're going to give you options for you to give us the correct oh, answer, obviously. Man. And then we're going to find out whether these answers are correct. I was correct wondering why you guys had your iPads <laughs> and I had my moment of truth coffee. Yeah. And we're going to add to the pressure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we have Mumsy on the line. Sue, good morning. Hi, good morning. Oh, <laughs> listen, oh, Sue, I just... Your mama's on the line. Sue, oh, Graham, Graham is so nervous this morning, he's literally <laughs> twitching in his left eye at the moment. It's ridiculous. I, so. can't, I can't believe you're doing this to me. I know that you, you are terrible with keeping secrets, but um, this, this is really impressive. Um, morning, Mom, I love you. <laughs> oh, morning, I love you too. The preamble for the nerves there. So, Sue, it's going to work like this. We're going to ask Graham the question, Oof. give him the three options he will answer, then you have to confirm whether the answer is correct or not. And I believe you also have some interesting stories to share about some oh, of the goodness. answers. Are you right? Okay. Fantastic. Right, right. First. Let's okay, go first. Cool. Question number one, Graham. Oh. Right, we'll start off with, this, with an easy one, okay? Graham. So, what is your mother's favorite color? Is it A, turquoise, B, green, or C, purple? That's a tough one. Um, I would have to say turquoise. Sue? Well, luckily for you, <laughs> I might actually like all three colors. I uh, know, so I was going to say, you actually... Yeah. <laughs> She's a real mom, yeah. yeah. No, all right, cool. Like Second question. <laughs> so we asked your mom what the worst Mother's Day gift you ever gave to her was, right? So was it <laughs> nothing, because you forgot to celebrate one year and never even called, B, uh, a beard trimmer, <laughs> I don't know why you did that. Or C, a fresh glass of fruit juice. Well, the, the funny thing is, uh, a beard trimmer has come into it, but it wasn't from me. It was actually from my grandmother, bless her. Um, so that wasn't courtesy of me. But I would have to say, in my misspent youth, that I might have actually forgotten Mother's Day one year. Is it true, I, I, Sue? I have a feeling. True? Sue, is it true? Well, um, uh, maybe I need to set the record straight. The beard trimmer was... Um, not for me personally, but my mother thought it would come in useful for cutting Graham's hair. <laughs> why, why she gave it to me for my birthday, I don't know. <laughs> All right, next one. One of the most interesting gifts from Graham, and I, I won't say it was the worst because it was very sweet. It was a typical breakfast in bed, homemade, which was like my usual Mother's Day nice, gift. Dude. And he made me a, a special fruit juice. But he garnished it from with flowers from the garden. As one does. But the flowers were, were covered in ants. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mama. I'm sorry. And yeah, I thought it's, that I thought that was one of the best um, things I'd given it you. Was one, it was one of the best, and I. I certainly had to hone all my skills to drink it without swallowing too many ants. <laughs> all right, all right. So here we go. We've, we've got one more question, okay? One more question, Graham. What is the one thing that your mother wears that she hasn't changed over 20 years? Ooh. And, okay. Is it A, her silver earrings, B, her flip-flops, or C, her perfume? Um, well, I know she has you know, used a particular kind of perfume for many years, but uh, one item of clothing that I've seen, and it's probably for longer than 20 years, for, probably from when I was a, um, a little child, her flip-flops. I think they are still the same flip-flops that she has been wearing <laughs> wow. since yeah, I, I can remember. Yeah, they are. They don't make them like they used to. Is this true, Mom? <laughs> This is absolutely true. I Yay! need to see these flip-flops. <laughs> <laughs> well That's done. A, oh, Mom, thank you so much. Look, I'm going to throw it in there just because I've, I've had to go through this kind of abuse. You know, most people in the world, they have to look to their national heroes, to those politicians, to those people who have done incredible things for their leading light. But you have been there with me from the day that I was born, giving me a leading light. Inspiration has been there every day. So thank you so much. You really are the guiding light in my own life. So thank you so much. I really do love you and appreciate you so much. Oh, thank you. Oh, man. So here's the deal, man. On that note, spoil your mom this Mother's Day with a cup 
of Truth Coffee. Get uh, voted, of course, the best coffee shop in the world. And we've teamed up with the nice guys at Truth to bring you a massive 20% discount on any online coffee order, including free delivery to major <coughs> cities. So buy your coffee on truthcoffee.com and use this coupon code, LATTE, that's a LATTE, um, as the coupon code to get a 20% discount on Truth Coffee. And it is. It's amazing. It's taken the edge off that challenge. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Time for a quick break. When we come back, we're making some beautiful peanut butter, bacon, banana flapjacks, and we also hook up with Blackbird. That was a lot of alliteration. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs>